Look at the division. I mean, this is – AFC North was the first division since, like, 1935. Couldn't even tell you what the divisions were back then that had everybody with a winning record. And you look yeah. at the quarterbacks, Joe Burrow, Lamar Jackson, Deshaun Watson. Uh, talk is the Steelers um, are interested in acquiring Justin Fields. It's starting to heat up. Uh, viewers of this show, Kenny, know I uh, – I think that would be a good move for the Steelers, and I hope they don't make it. Uh, take a listen to Lewis Riddick on Get Up and how he thinks Fields would fit in uh, to the Steelers. I like him a lot. I like him a lot. Look, I think of the effect that Arthur Smith had on Ryan Tannehill when Ryan Tannehill eventually took over for Marcus Mariota when they were down in Tennessee, and Arthur was calling plays down there. The play-action game with Justin under center on first and second down with the dynamic duo that they have at the running back position right there with Najee Harris and Jalen Warren, it is perfect. It's absolutely perfect. With the weapons with George Pickens and Deontay Johnson and Pat Fryermuth, are you kidding? With Justin, now that doesn't mean you have to park him under center all the time. They'll put him in gun. Mike wants to be a very multiple type of offense. But I think as far as letting the run game supplement what he can do as far as being a downfield, play-action, pass-oriented type of thrower, and then having design runs put in there for him, especially in the red area. Do you remember how much of a problem Ryan Tannehill was in the red area as a runner, as a runner-thrower? Just think of the possibilities here with a guy who's, who is infinitely more talented naturally than Ryan Tannehill, that being Justin Fields. Man, look. You know I don't, I don't, I don't want to like ever put anybody in front of my boy Kenny Pickett because Kenny's my guy. He's my guy. But Justin Fields is one of those dudes who I'd be like, might have to put him in front of you, Kenny. Might have to go ahead and work with this because Justin, in that offense, it would work. Kenny, can you imagine Lamar? I think Justin Fields is going to be a really good quarterback for somebody. Joe Burrow. <laughs> I mean, the quarterbacks in this division, if that does in fact happen, would be ridiculous. <clears throat> he would still be the worst quarterback in the division, okay? 40 touchdown passes, 30 interceptions. He's shown yep. some promise, and maybe he just needs a new team, a new offense with those weapons uh, that uh, were talked about right there in Pittsburgh. He would be an upgrade definitely over in Kenny. Kenny Pickett was a waste of draft pick. He's, Kenny Pickett reminds me of Colt McCoy, right? He's a backup quarterback for 12, 15 years in the league if he wants to play. He's not a starter in this league, and the Steelers are finding that out uh, the hard way. So Justin Fields, would he be a, a major upgrade? No, not a major upgrade, but he would be an upgrade. And bringing in Arthur Smith, that's an upgrade over their offensive coordinators that they've used over the last couple of years. Canada's gone, and whoever they put in his place uh, last year to finish the season. So it, it would make the Steelers a better offense, but... How much better? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, let's see if Justin Fields can take that next step.